Yo, what's really good? It's your boy Ace to the Boogie coming to you with another review. Now you see it, I have a two-piece hat club special. Then I also have something from J Tips. I do have a mystery box right here. I don't know what's in it. It could be any team, it could be any color. Make sure y'all stay tuned and see what's cracking with that. And of course, I do have the hat club specials, man. Something from the All-Star Game collection. Stay tuned. All right, now welcome back. We have the first box right here that we're going to get into. You see, we got the hat club joint. I do have my trusty box cutter, so you know what time it is. Peel back gang. We gotta slice it down the middle, then uh, peel it back. You know the vibes, man. Peel it back, man. Let's see what we got here, man. It's the first box, and we do have two hats in this joint, man. So we have the packing slip. We got two hats in this joint, man. Let's see what we got. Okay. First, we do have that Twin Cities right there. This is the Minnesota Twins, man. Twin Cities. You feel me? Size 7 and 1 8, man. I don't know if you've realized, but lately they're doing a lot of green bottoms, a lot of gray bottoms. They're going back to the originals, and I'm not mad at that. You feel me? Summer has kind of come and gone, so we got all the crazy colors out the way. You feel me? Now it's time to go back to some of the OGs, man. Right here, we do have a good green bottom on this joint. This was $50. You can go ahead and see right there. This is the Minnesota Twins All-Star Game. Let's see. We do have an all-black sweatband. We have the all-black sweat sweatband with the hat size, new era flag, and the Cooperstown collection. Now, look. I really wanted this hat because I had something in particular that uh, that I wanted to wear with, man. And I didn't have any newer uh, Twins hats. So I said, you know, let me go ahead and go for this one. I'm very glad I got it. And just look at the patch on this bad boy. This does say Minnesota all-star game 1965 but just look at the colors that they used on that you get some of that red you get some of that teal and you also get some of that blue man so you can't go wrong i mean i low-key could wear it with this sweater that i got on just based on the patch color itself and look come on man you already know the vibes man we matching everything we coordinating everything uh, i will be having a video on the uh nike the Nike fleece coming soon, so make sure you subscribe to the channel for that. But let me go ahead and throw this joint on, man, because, yeah, I've been waiting a while for that. Let's go ahead and, uh... oh, yeah. Okay, we got a good fit alert. Let me go ahead and give you some of this. Let me turn to the side, give you some of that side patch shot. Now, let me go ahead and show you what I would wear with this hat. And this is something that I would wear with this hat. Now, you already know I'm a jersey dude, you feel me, so... I had to go ahead and throw on the Minnesota Twins jersey, you feel me? Now, the interesting thing is, right here, I actually have an All-Star Game patch on this. Now, this patch is from 2014. This one, I believe, is 1965, so it's not the same All-Star thing. If it was, that would be super crazy, you feel me? But I had to give me a hat to go with this jersey, man. It looks fire. You know, in the fall, I'll probably throw like a little hoodie or something underneath it when the weather gets a little bit chilly. But, I mean, I love the look, man. So, let me go ahead and get to the other hat that is in this box. Here we have it. It is. Come on, man. This is like one of my favorite hats, just period, just of all time. You know why? My favorite color is orange, man. And I just love the way that orange and royal blue, they just go together like peanut butter and jelly. You feel me? So right here, we had the New York Mets hat, you feel me? All-Star game, we have 1964. 1964 All-Star patch, man. Joint is looking real clean. We got a lot of gold. We got a lot of uh, gold stitching on this bad boy. Let me get this little lint off. There you go. Yeah, man, a lot of gold stitching. Something that I really like, man. Classic hat green bottom man you can't go wrong with a green brim man like some of us are in here for the long haul you feel me like trust me i got a ton of pinks a ton of ices but you can never go wrong with the ogs you feel me like five years from now ten years from now 
an OG is going to be an OG, man. Greens, grays, you feel me? Like, just, they hold a special place in my heart, you feel me? But, yeah, man, this is the all-star game hat for the, uh, for the New York Mets. And I have a ton of Mets jerseys. I got a couple Mets jerseys that I can bust with this. But I'm going to try to show you guys something a little bit different. And uh, first, let me go ahead and take this off. Let me go ahead and put this bad boy on. And just so you know, that last hat was made in China. Let me check this one too. This one, we do have a made in China. This is made in China as well. You see, we got the all black sweatband on this, man. Let me go ahead and... Uh... Oh, yeah. Okay, I'm getting a good fit alert. So let me go ahead and give you some of that. Let me turn to the side, give you some of that side patch shot. Now, let me show you something that I would wear with this hat. And this is something that I would wear with this hat. Now, right here, I have the Adidas trefoil hoodie on in orange. You feel me? Like I said, orange is my favorite color. So you see the color match. You see the vibes, man. Let me go ahead and turn to the side, give you some of that side patch shot. And you feel me? Like I said, we're getting into the fall. We're getting into those winter months, man. So I decided instead of going with just a plain T-shirt, I decided to go with a hoodie. You feel me? Go ahead and uh, tie it up. Just in case it gets real chilly outside, you know the vibes, man. Next up, you see it, man. We got the Savior J Tips Mystery Box, man. So this is my first time getting a mystery box. If you don't know about J Tips, then you sleep, man. You gotta wake up, B. But let me go ahead and uh slice it down the middle. Peel it back, man. Peel back, gang. You know the vibes, man. We're gonna peel it back. Now look, man. I just hope. You know what, actually, I can't even front. I just I just saw the hat when I opened it up. And most of the uh the the I guess the most of the boxes that I've seen, there's actually a special box with like a question mark on it. And uh mine doesn't actually have one, which is a little bit disappointing because I was gonna add that box to my J Tips little collection over there. So I'm, I'm missing the box, man. You feel me? So B, what, what's really good, man? I, I, I kind of wanted that box. But anyway, let's go ahead and see what's inside. We do have a uh, a Savior sticker right here. This was from the uh, the LA pop-up, which I did attend, uh, Savior Tour 21. If you want to check out that video, I did a whole vlog on that. Go ahead and check the uh, description for that. But yeah, man, I'm missing my, my, my box, my mystery box, man. So yeah. Okay, ain't no, ain't nothing else in there, man. So right here, this is a uh, okay. This is cool. It's cool. It's a mystery, man. You know what they say in the mystery? You you gotta take your chances. Now, I can't say that I'm enthused. I'll say that because I do already have the LA and the New York in the same color, and I was hoping I would get like you know one of the Savior hats that says you know Savior on the back or something like that. So. I won't say I'm disappointed, but I'm not just enthused. But that's the chance you take when you go with a mystery box, man. But let me go ahead and give you a, a look at this. We have the Atlanta Braves right here. We have the 1999 World Series side patch. I mean, this is still a good hat, man. Like I said, for me, it's only because I have two other teams in this exact same color where I'm like, oh, you know, I wish I'd got something a little different, but you know. You win some, you lose some. We do have the all white sweatband. We have the Cooperstown collection, new hour, new era flag and the hat size right there. This is made in China. We have the icy blue bottom on this joint, man. So let me go ahead and take this bad boy off. Let me go ahead and put this on. I mean, at least we do have a good fit alert. We have a, a very good fit alert, man. Let me go ahead and turn to the side, give you some of that side patch shot. And let me show you what I would wear with this hat. And this is something that I would wear with this hat. Now, if you've seen before, I have done other unboxings of the same color, like the infrared with that icy blue. And I've always matched it with the infrared portion, whatever shirt I have on. But today I said, you know what? I'm just going with a Nike club shirt. You feel me? Match it with the brim. And uh, there we have it, man. It still is a good look. You know, like I said, you can't go wrong. This is one of those essential original J Tips colors, man. So I am glad to have this. And uh, let's go. We have Hat Club Box. And this is the uh, last hat for this video, man. So I appreciate you sticking with me. I appreciate you, Peel Back Gang. You know the vibes. 
make sure you sub up because i'm going to have more videos coming let's go slice it down the middle peel it back and uh, uh peel it back now let's see what we got we got pack and slip oh you know what and i just noticed we did not have pins with those other um well actually we didn't have a pin with this hat and we didn't have a pin with the other two hats. Now that might be because they're not considered like hat club exclusives as far as the colorways are concerned, but that's just something to note. There were no pins that came with those other uh, All-Star Game hats. Now let me go ahead and uh, show you what we have right here. We have a, ooh, okay. Oh yeah, real old school, real clean. We have that. St. Louis Cardinals right here, man. This is that old school cargo. It's very flat. Hopefully you guys can take it. You can see how flat that bad boy is. Yeah, it's like a really flat Cardinal. And remember, this is the uh, 1940 All-Star game. And the patch on this is bananas, man. Look at how big, pause, this patch is. This patch is the whole side. This is the 1940 All-Star game. And this is the main reason why I did go for this hat. Just because of that patchwork, man. You got your white, you got your silver, you got your white, you got your blue, you got your red. And just the size of that patch alone was worth grabbing this hat, man. Two-tone, you can't go wrong. $50, all black sweatband, man. No pin, no batter, man, on that. Just for anybody that's wondering. We do have a red button top. And uh, yeah, B, this is a really clean hat. This is a made in China. So let's go ahead and take this one off. Let me go ahead and put this bad boy on. Okay, got a little space. Boom, let me turn to the side. Give you some of that side patch shot. And let me show you what I would wear with this hat. And this is something that I would wear with this hat, man. You see right now, I have the Adidas trefoil crew neck on, man. And like Drake once said, they loving the crew, man. You feel me? I love a good sweater, man. Crew neck, hoodie, zip up. It really doesn't matter to me, man. But we got that red. We got the red. It is a two-tone, so you can't really go wrong, man. But let me go ahead and give you a little bit more of that side patch, man, because... The side patch is what does it for this joint, man. This joint is hit, man. I appreciate y'all checking out this video, man. Go ahead, like, comment, subscribe. Tell a friend to tell a friend, man. But it's your boy Ace to the Boogie, and I'm out.